Today I'm going to be doing my own lacing style named the blank checkerboard. Okay. Lace very top. You want it inside, not outside. So you can only see the design. How you want to make sure they're even is pull up this part of the lace, even out the aglets, and pull. Okay, now they're perfectly even. One, two, three, four up above this lace on the other side I'm going to lace it through here then on the inside I'm going to go back and I'm going to go to this second hole right there then you're going to repeat that all the way up to the last hole Make sure your laces are perfectly straight and not wavy. <clears throat> okay, there's the first part. Your shoe should look like that. Okay, second. So this is where it gets a little bit harder. We're gonna weave this lace into these ones. So the first one over, then under the second one, over the third one, and under the fourth one. And we're gonna push that through this. And then we're going to go back under all of these laces to that next empty hole right there. Okay. This time, we're gonna go under the first one, over the second one, under the third one, over the fourth one. should look like this so far then we're gonna go back under into this third hole right here sorry it's kind of under my lace right there There it is. Right. Now, repeat that pattern over the first one, under the second one, over the third one, and under the fourth one. And twist your laces if they're twisted. Through that third hole from the top. 
Go back under and go to this last empty hole right there. And this one, you're gonna go under the first one, over the second one, under the third one, and over the fourth one. Your shoe's gonna look like this. You can tuck them in or tuck them into your shoes or what I like to do is a factory knot. Wrap, wrap them around your fingers and pull through like you're tying a balloon. Tuck it under your tongue. And there's the final product. There's the blank checkerboard.